fugitive whose prison escape using a helicopter stunned French authorities. This morning, he's finally back in custody, captured after a three-month manhunt. ABC's Eva Pilgrim has the story. Good morning, Eva. Good morning, George. This French gangster is legendary, a serial jailbreaker known for breaking out in the most dramatic way. After months of speculation about where he was hiding, turns out he didn't go far. Arrested near Paris overnight. It was the daring jailbreak that seemed straight out of a movie. Notorious gangster Red One Fayed serving a 25-year sentence for murder, busting out of prison just south of Paris with the help of three accomplices wearing masks and dressed all in black. But this morning, Fayed is back behind bars after a three-month massive manhunt. French authorities are finally locating him in an apartment just north of Paris with four other men taking him back into custody. Fayed's prison break made headlines around the world with authorities calling the escape spectacular scratching their heads at the high level of planning involved. His accomplices hijacked this helicopter, then used guns to force the flight instructor to fly into the prison's courtyard. His fellow prisoners cheered his spectacular escape as he disappeared off into the distance. The getaway chopper later found burned near a suburb of Paris, launching a massive manhunt. Turn around. Put your hands behind you. Behind you. Behind you. Get out. Faid once said he would take his criminal inspiration from movies and actors such as Robert De Niro and Michael Mann's 1995 movie Heat, watching scenes hundreds of times in order to recreate them in real life. This was in Faid's first prison break. In 2013, he escaped after spending less than half an hour behind bars, blowing up doors with dynamite while using four guards as human shields. And this most recent escape was just insane. He got out in that helicopter, which landed in the one small area in the prison without netting over it. No room for error for them putting that helicopter there. And you said you were there. You actually saw that. Right. There was not much space. And apparently they had drones there previously. They were scouting it out just to see what they could do. And they were wow. able to carry it off. And I'm sure he's going to be a little more tighter locked yes. up next time. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Thank you so much, Eva. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.